an hour of regressing. You don't understand um, the, the curve of human competence. Sometimes you got to get a little bit worse to build better habits to do better. I think Sisyphus might have gotten to you. What do you mean gotten to me? I'm chilling. I'm not necessarily trying to be philosophical. I just like, sometimes people are like, why is NL life posting so much? It's because like every once in a while, someone my age, and I'll just leave it at that, pops into chat and is like, you should be getting madder that you're not like doing better in video games. And I'm like, buddy, you got me confused with like a mirror. It's, uh, I mean, we're, we're 35 years old. You want me to get mad at not doing better in Mario? Like that's, that's crazy to me that you would step into my chat and either say that explicitly or alternatively, just believe it in your heart of hearts. Like that's, I just got my priorities like in a different place. Now I get mad as fuck when I'm driving sometimes for sure. But I think that's like General Motors fault. And then maybe like ICBC, like I don't understand like how 20% of the drivers on the road got their licenses. Like when I see someone fuck up and almost kill me and my whole family in a car, and then I look at them and they're like 80, I'm like, oh, I get it. Cause like you got your license in 1955 when there were like eight cars on this street. And now you're just kind of holding on security through obscurity. But when I see someone make a mistake and they're like, you know, 40, I'm like, what the fuck happened, man? Didn't you have to pass, like, a real driver's license test? You know, I was, um... I, I forgot to mention this to you, but pretty, pretty funny thing. Um, so... You know how last names in Western worlds, last names used to be, like, your job or something? You know, there's, like, <clears throat> some traits to it anyways for korean last name it's a uh, location basically so even even when it's um for example even when it's just kim it's not just all kims are same there are different factions in kims like oh i am this kim which, which is mostly like location and and there are several types of kims and my kim is uh in kanji if i were to translate it like literally translate it it's a uh, blue wind i'm i'm blue wind kim which sounds super anime um and if i look at the ancestry of the blue wind kim um i got two like i got two queens in my blood one of which is the most famous queen in korea and there are several people actually known for um all the great stuff in korean history that they are actually in museum so you could say my blood is royal blood. You know what I mean? If Korea had, um, I guess, like hierarchy still, like the, the royal systems, I might be allowed to go to, you know, like the castle or whatever. And my, my Kim is so rare, it makes up about 1% of the overall other kims in korea so we're we're there's only ten thousand of us whereas i think the last name kim is like 21 percent of korean people so it's like there are a lot of kims but there's only ten thousand of us so i'm like i'm super rare also royal blood and finding that history of you know, my bloodline was super cool. So I showed it to Ryan. Ryan was like, oh, cool. And that was about it. And then my daughter goes like, oh, I want to be a princess. I'm like, well, technically, you might be a princess. Because we, we are from, like, the royal descent. So, you know. Um, and then I messaged my 
mother-in-law, so Ryan's mom, about it as well because she's interested in all this stuff. And then she said, wow, that's awesome. Super cool. Well, she said she did her own, you know, history check of her family side. And then she said, she said her family is as long like as far as she can trace um her family line was people who love to eat potatoes and farm potatoes and push a lot of boxes of potatoes up the hill so she got a lot of photos of her great grandparents and such pushing up by crazy big boxes Full of potatoes up the hill. <laughs> and then I said, No wonder why Ryan loved to play Sisyphus. Because that's in his blood, bro. His blood is to push heavy objects up the mountain, dude. No wonder why he freaking loved it. He found the inner peace because that was his bloodline. <laughs> Pushing heavy shit up the hill. Oh. So it became like really funny. I was like, oh, look at this. I have all this history in my blood. You know, all that kind of crazy stuff and reading through histories and all that. And then <laughs> Ryan's mom goes like, yeah, we, we love potatoes. We love eating potatoes. We love growing potatoes. We love potatoes so much that we pack that shit up in a huge box and push it up the hill. <laughs> so it's, a, so it's a, Ryan's bloodline is literally like, you can sum it up with one word, potato. He's definitely uh, like Mr. Potato. <laughs> and you know, honestly, Ryan loves potatoes. And Ryan's family loves potato, and that 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 is his blood, man. It's in the bloodline. Korean queen married <laughs> Sisyphus, but isn't Sisyphus like a a uh, bad person, right? I forgot the like he is pushing up the boulder because he did something bad, right? Like he's in the jail. He was an evil king or something. Well, hold on. If he was an evil king, and I was a Korean queen, that kind of is sick, bro. That's kind of sick, bro. That's some princess maker 2 shit right there, man. <laughs>